Hey, hey, my people! We do from the Great Start Studio. Well, my dreams are coming true. It's true. It's true. There was nothing here. Like this was just a gravel lot, like like two years ago. So I want to talk to you again about drumstick illustrations. I've been teaching since '82, thousands of students, and I just constantly come across these illustrations that I use with the drumsticks. So I want to share them with you. I hope they get in there. They get in deep. Get in there where they're supposed to be. I want to talk to you about the two spectrum ends here. The one end in drumming is your layered sort of drumming in, and the other end is your linear drumming in. I'll explain that here in a second. In fact, I just happen to have right here, number two, volume two, out of the, uh, the whole series. If you want to do a deep dive, this is the way to do it. This is the way I wish I was taught. It goes through playing left and right handed. It plays through all the fills, plays through the styles, plays through the meters, plays through two line. It's the way I wish I was taught. This whole thing passes through these ideas I'm talking about. But the first level, these first 10, are all based in the layered world. The layered world is the world that we usually operate in for songs that's over here, the layered world. That's where you get a constant going, one and two and three and four and, and you literally just play on top of that constant, one and two and three and four, or one and two and three and four, or one and two and th one and two and three, and lots of different layerings, but the idea is still the same. Something keeps going one E and a two E and a three E and a four, and you just play notes, configured notes underneath of that. There's a certain safety net to it. I, oh, I got, there's too much. I gotta talk real, <laughs> I gotta make these short. And once again, if you want the deep dive into that thing, get the series. It talks about that. So right here is the layered part. That's what I'm talking about. That's what the series is basically built out of um, the first level. Level two of the series is all linear. It's all the completely linear thing. That's where you play note after note in a line. Linear means line. So that would be... And every note is in a row in a line. Now, there can be spaces in there, which makes it really cool, too. But the idea is, is that you're not basing it out of layered notes. When you start getting this overall overarching idea of what drumming is, that you either are on one end of the spectrum from layered, moving towards linear by breaking it up more and more, and then you have linear where you are layering it more and more. The notes become more and more layered, but it's based in a linear world. Very, very different. There's no safety nets over here. I'll, I'll do a bunch of videos talking about how the, 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 the mental dynamic of that is very, very different. This is always morphing, this, this linear idea. This has something established and other parts morph against this established part. The very short of it is, is that, once again, you wanna be a full spectrum person. You don't wanna just live over here you don't want to just live over here. You want to have both of these worlds combined until it's just one thing where you could dance across from one end to the other. This gives me an overall philosophy of what it is and where it is in the spectrum that these things line up in. It also gives me a philosophy of how to practice so that I don't just practice in one part of the spectrum, so that I actually practice in the full spectrum so that I'm ready for any kind of ideas that I have. Now, there's you have to be ready for ideas that other people want you to have for their music when you're hired, but when you are free as an artist to just create what you want, one of the very first quotes I ever came across was, uh, we seek not the masters, but rather we seek what they sought. We're not trying to be them, I hope. <laughs> I hope you're trying to be you. You uh, are so much more specialized than, they, they were specialized in their life, and they sought the freedom to reveal their specialization of how unique they are. That's what we want to do wherever we are so we understand this whole spectrum. So it's really like a buffet of opportunities so that we can reveal ourselves as artists. I just want to say thanks for uh, following me on these. If you want the whole list, there's a playlist of these that I'm making on my channel. Uh, that's in the link below, Larry London uh, uh, Drummer. It will walk through all these different overarching sort of ideas that you can then place yourself into and make a plan. Just take a minute and subscribe and like and comment. Those things really help the algorithm and help me get my work out to the world. And I really appreciate it. So from the Great Start Studio, back at it.